We begin with the shark attacks in North Carolina. One beach, two attacks, 90 minutes apart. And authorities say this hasn't happened in decades. The first 911 call at 4.12 p.m. Sunday afternoon, an hour and a half later, a second victim two miles down the beach, and all of it coming just days after another shark attack 30 miles away. Tonight here, you will hear those 911 calls as we get late word on the victims. The 12-year-old girl seen there, people trying to help her face down on the beach. One woman looking on in horror, and the other victim, a 16-year-old boy, each attacked in shallow water. And look at this, an image taken from the water's edge. That's a fin there, and ABC's Matt Gutman leads us off from the scene. The chopper skimming the water, boats hunting a silent predator, blamed for two horrific maulings in waist-deep water. The first attack happened around 4 p.m. Sunday, right off a pier on Oak Island Beach. There's a girl whose hands been bitten off by a shark. That 12-year-old girl bitten in her arm and hip, bystanders dragging her to the sand, helpless, furiously trying to save her life. Onlookers like this woman, horrified. Then, just 90 minutes later, another attack, just two miles up the beach, and another frantic call. I mean, I'm always out of your emergency. This time, a 16-year-old male victim, also airlifted to a nearby hospital, he lost his arm. Both are in stable condition tonight, but the horror of the twin attacks even stunning authorities here. Have you ever encountered an incident where you've had two shark attacks of that kind of severity in the same day? I have not encountered in my 16 years one shark attack. Despite the attacks, the beaches remain open for business. We went up for our own bird's eye view, seeing families in the water. And the spot where a beachgoer captured this picture of two fins in the shallows. The sheriff's office says there was a sighting. It may have been a shark, it may have been something else. Right after we headed out on the water with Sheriff John Ingram. We spotted a couple of sharks uh, close to the surf uh, that were about seven foot long. About the approximate size that people think may have attacked the kids yesterday? Well, it, it's certainly similar to the size. David, now the sheriff says that the sharks they saw this morning and the sharks they saw yesterday right after the attack were probably seven foot long bull sharks. Now he says men up in those helicopters and in the boats are authorized to shoot them if they see them. David. All right, Matt Gutman in North Carolina.